Hello guys. Today I'm gonna show you how to create a new job in Mosaic. I'm gonna create a very simple one. Then I will show you some samples that I already created. So simply go to the files here and click on new. Just type the name. I'm gonna type the name sample. And you can add your customer name, ABC, whatever, address here, and phone number here, and email, anything. So second step is go to the settings. So this is the main part where you can perform some task so you can complete your job so this is the door drawer and fronts so i'm gonna select the uh, standard library here so this here you can change according to your uh, requirement you can use slab doors shaker doors whatever and go to drawings and uh, i mean drawers so this is the drawers library where i can choose according to your hardware so this is the material this is the important part you can select the material uh, from this bar so this is the main part because you're gonna cut your uh, cabinets and uh, to add the material in this bar I will make another video on that how to add it so you can change the settings here so this is the library over here you can see the construction method so construction method is most important just click on here and choose the construction method i choose my company construction method so in this construction method basically there are the cabinets that you saved and uh, that are pre-designed by the mosaics so go to the room click on draw wall so first of all you have to draw one wall according to your measurement i'm gonna create let's say 100 inches just add the size here and enter so this change the size to 100 inches here you can also adjust the height and thickness and you can rotate this or you can even join the two walls like say add wall just click on this dot and they will ask you to join just click join make this like or if you think you wanna resize you can resize from here or even you can just put the manual numbers here so you can resize moreover if you think you don't want this wall just select this there is a cross here and just press on that and then yes next thing go to products right here oh i can also show you what's uh, what else in room so right here is island in your kitchen you can uh, design the island from these options this is a single side double side l shape and moreover you can also add window to your wall and you can just uh, resize the uh, window size here and you can also add the sink if you have a sink cabinet in your drawing in your layout you can just add this sink on the top of the sink cabinet so that so your customer will understand easily so dishwasher here fridge here range here just add anything and you can change the size after go to products so right here this is frameless v8 that's my construction method that's the library i choose so right here these are the couple of pre-designed and i designed some and i just saved on this bar so the thing is you can easily pick up the cabinets and change the size after so click on this 
wall and there is an option right here this one this is for the view the elevation just view the elevation here i'm gonna make this uh window to the center so right here you can see these options this c will give you the the window to the center okay so let's say i'm gonna add a sink here so i made this cabinet sink base so the bottom cabinet we uh, we also call base and the upper cabinet we call wall cabinet so the base cabinet i just click on this cabinet i just drag to on this wall so i just align this cabinet here to the center and to center of the window so i have some space here i'm just showing you uh, this one as a sample but you can customize according to you so i'm gonna put some two cabinets here you can also put the end panels on the sides but i'm just gonna put some two cabinets so i'm gonna put this cabinet with the two doors and one drawer just drag out here and you can also change the size of the here the standard size i use is 34 three quarter height and uh, you can just click on this arrow to resize it or you can just type the manual numbers here to resize it so i'm gonna put these two cabinets here like that so i think i should add some wall cabinets here like this like this so you can see in this wall cabinet there are two shelves here here and the base cabinet one shelf here one shelf here one drawer here one drawer here you can customize these but i will show you that in different video how to customize that okay so this is it you can also check the 3d view of it uh, i think this video will not allow but i can attach these screenshots so right here i told you if you want to add a sink go to the room go to sink click on sink your sink is here so go to product again go to elevation just click on the sink and drag it to the middle of this cabinet yeah so this is pretty easy as long as you know how the things look like so go to the files i'm gonna show you some other examples that i actually made for one house so i'm gonna show you this so okay Let's click on elevation so this is a kitchen a big kitchen this is pretty easy to design but you have to think how your kitchen will look like how you want it so i put this cabinet here here it's gonna be uh, your oven and here microwave and this is for the uh, wine rack so you can see this here two fridges gonna be here and these two top cabinets and these some cabinets so you can see this is the island here and the countertop will be on this island here and you can also add a room here just click on the new room so i made these three rooms here i made this laundry so in the laundry they have these two machines here and these two cabinets on the top this is the washroom cabinets so in this house there are one two three four five five washrooms so i just designed and uh, you can also write uh, and make a note on it so yeah this is it just give me a favor just follow me for more details i will keep posting more videos so it will help you to learn the mosaic software
Thank you.